hey everybody and welcome back to our channel in today's video we are going to show you how to back up on windows 10 let's begin now the first thing that you need to do is to log in using your credentials if this is your first time on windows 10 i want you to click the sign up option and from here just follow the on-screen instructions and you're good to go Backing up on OneNote on Windows 10 ensures you have a secure copy of your notes in case of accidental deletions, device issues, or syncing problems. Now, using the OneNote's built-in backup feature, which only is accessible on the desktop version, all right? For example, if you're using the Microsoft OneNote 2016 desktop application, not the Windows 10 app from the Microsoft Store, you can create local backups. So how do we do it? I want you to go to the upper left corner where you can see the file section click on it and then i want you to hover to the bottom left corner where you can see the options click that if you do that what will happen is you have an option here that says save and backup i want you to click on it and from here you see you can customize how one note all right saves and backup your notes you have the option to automatically back up the notebook at the following intervals, which are one week, one minute. It depends on your preferences and likeness. One hour, two hours, 30 minutes, six weeks, and whatnot. So it's, it's up to you, right? So you can back up notebooks stored on OneDrive in SharePoint. You also have an option for that. You would also like to put in the number of backup copies to keep. For example, 69... You also have the app option to backup change files now or backup all notebooks now. I'm not going to do this right now because it will take a little while because I have so much data. All right, so I'm not going to cover that. But if you have, if, it, if you want it, just click on it. Now, the percentage of unused space to allow in files without optimizing is something that you might want to do later if you want it. But for now, we're going to be focusing on the backing up on one note. But of course, the optimizing files is an option for you to not get too much data it's optimized for that you also have an option for the uh, cache file location modifying the OneNote cache file location is now recommended because any unsync changes will be lost all right so i want you to click on the ok button if you do that you would be able to save and backup your uh, data here on windows 10. another option if you don't have the uh, microsoft OneNote on windows 10 application if you are logged into your Microsoft Notebook, the web version, you see this is going to be the notebook. You can simply export that. There should be a pop-up window that will happen. And once it appears, you click that export and this will serve as your backup data if you're using the Microsoft OneNote, the web version right it's that simple export to download your notebook content if your notebook is large this could take a while and just click on export and you would notice that the uh, file was successfully exported and you can use that file as a complementary backup data another option is right click the notebook open in the new tab or window another option is go to the file go to the print section why because if you print this you can basically save it as a pdf all right what will happen is if you save it as a pdf that would serve as a backup data in the form of pdf all right and that's it for today's video thank you so much for watching we will see you again in the next one